Hey guys! Today we're making some cute Rolakuma or bear inspired waffles and a waffle maker. Hope you'll enjoy! I first roll out two thin sheets of scrap clay. I cut one of them into tiny squares and place them on top of the other sheet. Once you have an area that is about the size you want the waffles, you want to cut out the bear shape. After baking, you can use it to make the waffle texture on a thicker sheet of clay, then cut out that shape and bake again. I used cornstarch so it wouldn't stick. Next, I made both of them into molds. One is going to be a waffle and the other one is going to be used for making the waffle maker. I first filled up the one for the waffle maker with a mix of TLS and black pastel. Then bake that to create part of the inside. You're going to need four of these. Put this on top of a thin sheet of black clay and take another sheet, cut out the bare shape from the waffle and place this on top. You then want to put them together two and two to create the inside of the waffle maker. I then covered both of them with pink clay. Obviously you can use whatever color you want. I made the handle from the same piece and I just flipped it around before smoothing it out. After baking I used a file to smooth everything out. I also added some more clay to add some details to the top and some feet to the bottom and baked again. You then want to cut away a piece of the colored clay from the back of both the top and bottom. And this is to make room for the hinges. I made the hinges from four crimp beads and a piece of brass wire. I glued two of the crimp beads to the top and two of them to the bottom, then added the wire and sealed off the ends using glue. I also made and glued on this back piece and this is just so that the waffle maker will only open to a certain angle. Lastly, I just wrote Rilakkuma with white acrylic paint on the top and then for the inside I added some extra details using black acrylic paint. Then just glaze the outside with a thick layer of glass clays. You can then use your second mold and a light dough color to make the waffles. If you want, you can leave them as they are. I just add some texture using a toothbrush and a needle tool. After baking, I added some shading using soft pastels. I applied two shades with a wet brush, then sealed it with a matte glaze. Added a tiny bit of brown acrylic paint and added some glass glaze on top. For the syrup, I mixed Fimo Deco Gel and Soft Pastel. And after baking, I made and added some strawberries. Tutorial for making strawberries can be found on my channel. Lastly, I made a simple spatula. 
I first made the head, then added a strip of metal and baked, and then added the handle. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next tutorial.